106 oscillator. Pitch control. Volume control. And sync. Sync has a course control on the left here. Pitch up a little bit. And a fine sync control on the right. Adjusting the pitch, adjusting the sync. Adjusting both. Sync off. And power off. Here's a schematic for the oscillator. There's the main oscillator right here that produces the sound. It's got a 100k pot there with a 6.8k ohm resistor there to control the pitch to bring it down a little bit. Here's a 150 nanofarad capacitor that goes to ground. And over here is the sync oscillator. And there's a diode here uh, in between the two. But the sync oscillator is basically set up the same way as the main oscillator with a Schmidt trigger going to capacitor since larger. You've got a 15 microfarad capacitor here. So that way it's a little bit longer. So this one's in the audio frequency and this is an LFO frequency that um, gets up near the audio range, uh, which is how we got those sounds in the beginning. It's got a 100K uh, potentiometer here, a 220 ohm uh, stop resistor and then a 10k for the fine tuning. So this is the course adjustment for the sync speed and this is the fine adjustment for the sync speed. Uh, we have that going through two of the other uh, Schmidt triggers here. They invert so I go once and then twice and then that goes to the LED that's gonna flash at the same rate that the sync is going to occur. And then over here um, I have this going out to a buffer Schmidt trigger because we have six on the chip so we might as well use them. We actually use only five here in the whole project. And then over here is the, um, it's basically going to be the uh, ACD coupler. So that way we get a signal that goes positive and negative because we're using a positive 12 volt DC that goes to ground. Uh, for an audio signal we want it to oscillate around zero, not going from zero to 12. So this will bring that to the middle. Uh, make it friendly for audio gear, which is also what this is here for. This is the volume control um, to bring it down to more of a line level or to have a little bit of freedom with how loud it's going to be. So 100k uh, potentiometer, 47k resistor here. This goes to ground. And then over here we've got, um, this right here is to AC couple. Um, and this basically is just a big capacitor that's going to help it with any sort of uh, volume or voltage fluctuations that may occur. And that's the circuit. This is the power supply. It's just a 12 volt DC power supply wall wart with a switch soldered in there. Just cut off the barrel plug and add that instead.